Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Chris coming to you with another one of my crazy crossroads. Big Joey C, Big Rob, old baby Blue Eyes is with me. We're at the Spring Hill Cemetery tonight. We just had to get out and uh, and kind of venture out into this crazy place tonight and sort of uh, clear our minds a little the way we like to do it. So this is therapy for us, believe it or not. So uh, it's uh, the sun just setting. We're going to try and beat the, uh, what is it, the 9 o'clock curfew so we don't get in trub trouble with the law. So um, we're going to go out here, check this place out, and see what we can get into. I touched my face. Look. Touch my face. Touch my face. It touch his face. We're going to touch his face. They got it. Love you guys. Peace. Look at that sunset behind us, how beautiful that looks. Or creepy. It kind of looks a little creepy, too. But All right, guys. Here we are. We're going to give it a shot, see what we can get into tonight. Um, <clears throat> my vow to you at home watching this is that if we're going to be quarantined or whatever might be, you know, in our future here, um, I'm going to try and bring, bring some videos to your home so you guys uh, have something to watch and hopefully bring a smile to your face because uh, right now it's just, man... Everything's negative, 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 and everybody's scared. The grocery stores are out of control. People are fighting over toilet paper. This is where this has come to, and it's just, it's crazy. It's crazy, but... I don't know what that noise is, but... Anyway, here we go. Now, there are a couple other people that are um, here as well. Not sure what they're up to, but this is kind of the earliest we've ever been out. <laughs> and this is where the actor is buried, Michael Teleferio, I believe his name is. And off of this backside here, all these woods, it's kind of where Joe was talking about. Maybe we can walk back there and check that out as well. And I hope for everybody that's home watching this, I hope everybody is in, uh, watching this in good health. And has clean hineys. This place is just like... Very sketched out. I let Joe and Rob kind of go ahead of me. Not really sure if that was Joe or not.
Playback. Might have been a coyote. What a perfect sound for a cemetery. I think that was a coyote. Which, uh, real crazy story, real fast. Um, a friend of mine, a very good friend of mine, he uh, was walking his dog about a week and a half ago and was attacked by a coyote. He, he went to protect his dog, ended up getting 68 stitches. His arm has to be in a sling. This thing really messed him up. The good thing is we don't have a dog with us, and it seems like the coyotes go after other dogs. So if there's a coyote around here, hopefully we'll be okay. I want to say I did hear, I think I heard a voice back here, over by where those dolls were. <clears throat> and again, like I always say, every cemetery, if I capture anybody's name, I mean no disrespect to the families. <clears throat> and like always, I apologize for my throat, guys. I know some people make comments about it. A lot of it has to do with my disease. My muscles are always spasming in my throat. And then on top of that, my sinuses stink too. Was here the last time. We heard some crazy stuff back here.
because they're very hard to distinguish if that's Rob he's, he's close to me talking or am I hearing something I'm going to sort of join Joe back here. <clears throat> you okay? You okay? Joe? Yeah. You go okay? Yeah. <clears throat> All right, I'm going to join Joe back here in this wooded area. He's right over there. I don't know. What's what's cool about this, hey Joe, this is what I would never expect is the outlying of the cemetery. Oh shoot! You would think that these woods were so dense, and then we walk in here. It's all wide open. I do. Yeah. Welcome to Florida. I got these stupid things all over me. What was that, bro? What the hell was that? Did you hear that? I did, Joe. <laughs> So 
is just so weird how it's wide open. <laughs> A lot of the footsteps are so heavy that there might be some things we hear on playback, um, or if you hear, obviously, down below, give us a comment. I do, uh, I do see all the comments, guys. Reminds me of this old game I used to play called Pitfall, where you'd swing from vines. Look at that. You hear that? You okay? Yeah. Cobweb? Yeah. <clears throat> wow, I'm gonna shut this light off for a second. Look at this. About an eerie feeling. Did you hear like that bang earlier? What bang? Just about two or three minutes ago when you walked in. Oh no! Talking. I'm gonna head back out this way.
just gonna take a quick little break here. Now the woods are definitely creepy, but uh, I wanted to come back into the cemetery area here. Look at all this garbage on me. Um, give you guys a bit of an update too on what's going on with our situation at the house. Um, everybody's been asking a lot of questions about my dad and um, he's he's hanging in there. We've had him back at the house for a little bit over a week now so seems to be doing pretty good. Um, he just doesn't have much strength to do much of anything really and uh, on top of that you know he's 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 sad depressed you know it's a pretty crappy situation but uh, all in all he's eating well he's being taken care of you know I have uh, I bathe them I feed them and uh, try and keep them somewhat happy um, unfortunately I haven't taken them anywhere due to the fact of what's going on um, he has a respiratory issue COPD and emphysema <clears throat> so being that if he were to unfortunately catch his corona virus it would probably be the end form for sure um, and with his dementia he, he, he gets a little frustrated he wants to go places and I gotta just try and put him off as much as I can um, I know it's got to be frustrating for him but I like I said I want to protect him and make sure he's safe uh, especially under my care so uh, Hopefully he stays out of the hospitals for a bit too. But uh, all in all, everything else is, is going really well. Um, I wanted to be a part of more videos this month. Unfortunately, as everybody knows, I always mention it with our circumstance that we're dealing with. Um, it's just, it's just, it's tough. So, um, but we're hanging in there and I hope everybody that's watching this once again is healthy and happy. I'm going to head back into the cemetery. And our Florida winter is gone. It's about 85 degrees today. See, there's some people over there. And I don't know what they're doing, but uh, I think they might be doing the same thing we're doing. I'm going to head back over here where I thought I heard something. see what these two ladies are up to. <clears throat> they say hello.
Oh, hello. Sorry to disrupt you guys. <laughs> uh, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> oh, what do you have an EMF meter or uh -huh. spirit box? Oh, yeah. Uh, Melmeter and just record. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Hi, I'm <laughs> Chris. Hi, I'm Debbie. Hi, Debbie. Nice hello. to meet you. I'm Chris. <laughs> Hi, Debbie. You guys okay to be on YouTube? Oh, we on YouTube. Say hello. Yeah. <laughs> sure. This is what we do. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Are you with a group or? Uh, well, I have my own channel, Seas Crazy okay. Crossroads, and then my buddies are with uh, Urban Ghost, Urban Exploration. Okay, so so. I need to. I need to. Get that. Oh yeah. Oh, I'm sorry to bother you guys. No, you're not bothering us. No, no. Are you getting know. anything? We don't know yet. We've not listened back. We've not heard anything. The temperature's dropped a few times when we've asked, but not yeah. drastically. I came a few nights ago with my friend Lynette, uh -huh. and the temperature would go down to six, 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 six to six. Oh, six. nice, so, right? Yeah, mm. very nice. <laughs> but nothing that drastic to know. Over, uh, over by where the dolls were. Uh -huh. I haven't turned on my, uh, my. Uh, necrophonic yet but okay. we were getting a little i was getting a little something over there but yeah that top left hand corner every time i come makes me feel sick i don't get a sickness that's anywhere that's the else. spot yeah yeah but over there always i get sick and i came on saturday night with some friends and i threw up <laughs> oh no so, oh yeah. no but that that i haven't been up there today we went okay. to the little girl's grave mm -hmm. is that where all the um dolls are and yes. stuff okay yeah, yeah. okay but, um, well, great. Yeah, take uh, take down. Okay, all right. So, I think I'll. Uh, let me see. You'll be on this video. Oh gosh, I don't. I'm scared to look at that. <laughs> if it's okay, if you don't want, I can cut this. It's no problem. No, that's fine. Okay, I need to make a note. I'm gonna have to figure that out. Do you have YouTube notes. on your phone? Yeah, I do. That's, yeah. yeah. There you go. That's the logical thing, right? <laughs> and just now, hit do search. I no. And right. type in C apostrophe S, and it's the top one. What's an apostrophe? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't put that on there. <laughs> uh, it's that, uh, that one right there next to the exclamation. Okay. And there it is. Oh. There you go. Okay. You got it. Awesome. All right, guys. All right. Well, thank you. Well, nice thank to you. Too. You too. I'm sorry to interrupt Be you. Too. No, you're not interrupting us at all. All right. Thank you. Good night. <clears throat> yeah, I'm definitely going to. Such nice ladies. I'm gonna definitely head back there because they said that's where they were feeling some temperature drop and everything. So I thought I heard some voices. So I'm gonna go check that out for sure. So my camera just shut off and I don't know what we, what part we got, but it, um, it definitely, <clears throat> um, by them mentioning that the temperature dropped in this area, I don't know if it's in my head, um, but it feels cooler over here. So it's hard to say because they got some cool gadgets though. But this is the place where I feel different. And it is kind of interesting how they said that this was the area that they feel the same way.
Okay, their voices are traveling, so, because Joe's over there talking to them. But I hear something right back here. Is there someone back here? Hello? Alright, that was me, I believe. I think I, I think that was connected. And when I stepped on this board, that board bounced up at me. Scared the hell out of me. <clears throat> this area is very, very eerie. <laughs> is this where you were saying it got cooler in this area? No, this no. is where she would get. This is where I always get sick. Yeah. By this tree. In that back corner there was freaky. Yeah. But I don't know. This is this is the area that every single time I come, I feel sick, and I'm feeling sick now. Are yeah. you really? Yeah. Nauseous? No, it's just yes. Is it in your head now that you think every time you I come here? I think so. <laughs> okay, because it's happened to me where I just yeah. all of a sudden and... It's like start. here, look, the, with all the solar lights, you can be down at the bottom and you, your mind plays tricks with you and you think you can see things walking in front yeah. of the solar yep. lights. Yeah, yep, But yeah, this area is creepy to me. But it's the, it's the corner where your car is uh -huh. that we get the 666. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, this over here is, seems like it, the freakiest part for me. Yeah. But now the last time I was here, kind of at the end of that trail there, oh my gosh, we picked up some crazy noises and just, oh, it was weird. Yeah. Oh, so yeah. weird, yeah. When you, if you walk this and you go down that way, it always feels like something's following you. Yeah. Have you noticed <laughs> yeah. that too? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was feeling back here yeah. and I thought I heard something back there, so. But could be any kind of animal or who knows. Yes, that's right. Oh boy. All right, guys, have fun. Good night. If you need us, just scream. <clears throat> Thank you.
Georgia. <clears throat> Hey Joe, have you um, the last time we were here, remember over here we heard all those noises? Yeah, right back here, that's what I was just saying. This back corner, uh -huh. where those two ladies are now, mm -hmm. I'm telling you man, I heard something, I thought there was a person right there. Alright, so I just caught up with Chris and he's telling me that on this side of the cemetery, he's <clears throat> It was like there was a ton of like movement, all kinds of crazy stuff. The voices were hard to tell because you know when you it was when you met those ladies, and uh, they got some cool equipment too, don't they? Yeah, they do. You know, I don't want to use their equipment. And um, <clears throat> when we first got here, I went over by where the little dolls are, mm -hmm. and I swear I heard a voice. See, they're over here now. You know. Right. That's what I was saying, that this part of the cemetery freaks me out, too. A little too much sometimes. In that back area, I just felt really strange. And she said back by where our car was, mm -hmm. that the temperature dropped to 6.6. Six, six, six. Yeah, I know. She was showing me that's crazy, right? So I was thinking about that, and I was over like where Rob is right now, and I'm like, I don't know if it's just in my head, but it felt so much cooler over there. You heard that? There's like a little, like a, a little talking, right? See, now the thing about it is Chris is here, Rob's over there, and those women <clears> are <throat> way back there. Now this voice came from over here. It's pretty cool though, but I don't know where it's coming from. I thought it was right here. You know what I would love to do? I'd love to come out here with, the, with Rob's drone and just fly over this because it seems like this side of the cemetery yeah. there's something so what if there's like a house right there and maybe people are messing with everybody that comes back here there is no house back there, there isn't yeah no there isn't now the only thing that was <clears throat> back there was like some old slaughterhouse that nobody seen the oh fire. really yeah you know i noticed a flashlight getting dim man is it really yeah and it was fully charged. There's somebody here. Come, come, stand right over here. Feels like the the air comes on. You all right, Rob? Yeah. Oh, it's kind of cold over here. Right? Feels nice. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. <laughs> it's a really nice cool breeze coming through here. But come back here with me, Joe, cause. Is somebody like famous? Yeah, look at that. That's so sad, dude. I, you know what? 
I really love coming up for a long time, man. <clears throat> There's something, I, I, it just feels like there's a presence here. I hear something moving. <clears throat> I hear faint voices. Now it's hot again, right here. That's crazy, Joe. Uh, Rob? What'd you hear? Jordan, that's for sure. And now it's cold right here, Rob. Come here, Rob. Is that the ladies? I am literally sucked into this place right now. I'm really enjoying this explore. Sadly, it is coming to an end. I can't wait to hear the playback though.
we're wrapping it up. That's unbelievable. Every time I move this camera, my finger moves that. So I'm sorry every time I zoomed in or however. Oh my goodness, I got junk all over me. But uh, I'm going to wrap it up, guys. Once again, I hope you're at home watching this in good health. And uh, within the next coming days, weeks, I'm sure myself, Urban Ghost, Urban Exploration, all the Todd from Holy Walkers, everybody that's out there doing what we do. If you're quarantined, we're going to give you plenty of uh, plenty of things to watch. If not, go back and watch the old stuff too. We're good with that. But uh, I want to say thank you to everybody. Please be safe. Wash your hands. Take care of the elderly. All the good stuff. Um, don't forget to subscribe, like, thumbs up, all that good stuff. See everything down in the description. Uh, merchandise, mailing address, all that good stuff is down there. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I, I really enjoyed tonight. Tonight wasn't tonight just a fun night. Yeah, I mean, it was, it was just a was really nice explore. Some steam. I really think we caught some good stuff, but yeah. you know, until we hear it back on playback, who, who knows? Um, and like always, make sure you tell me in the comments and Joe and everybody what you guys might have heard. But until next time, guys, hopefully it's sooner than, than later if we get something out, out there for you. And uh, we can be quarantined with you at home. So we'll see you soon. Deuces. Love you.